Hi guys, what is going on? It's Dyson Dazzle Nine today, and today, guys, I'm going to be bringing you a fully legit tutorial on how to get Save the World for free. Now, guys, this works 100% of the time. However, every single time you load up the game, you will have to do this. But on the positive side, every single thing you do in Save the World will save. So it's not that difficult of a glitch to get down. So once you've done it, it'll take you like I don't know a minute or two to get on to Save the World um, using this glitch, and all your progress will have been saved. So yeah, guys, as I said at the start of the video, epic. This is completely you know, just for educational purposes only. As I said, if you enjoy the game, just use this to test it, and if you really like it, buy it, you know, support the devs. There's gonna be no advertising on this video because therefore it is for non-profit and educational use only, so it falls under the fair use policy. But yeah, let's get straight into it. Okay guys, so I'm gonna keep this completely above board. I'm gonna go ahead and create a brand new account straight in front of you guys because I wanna make sure you guys can see that this is legit, that I'm not just, you know, I don't know, just sign into a profile that's already, you know, got saved the world or just something along those lines. I want to make sure you guys can, you know, perfectly see that this is a 100% a legit tutorial because I know there's going to be a lot of people that will probably call me out and say, oh, this is definitely fake. But so, yeah, that's why I'm going to go ahead and create a brand new account straight in front of you guys. So I'll jump back to you guys after that has been done. Okay guys, so for the start of this glitch, you're going to make sure you go into your settings and you go to your network settings and you actually make sure you're hovering off go offline. Now, I think you have to have a wireless connection to this, but I'm not 100% sure. But you should just make sure you get to there, go to save the world, click A on learn more, click A on the founders pack. Then what you want to do is you want to hit X to purchase, but at the same time you press X, you want to make sure you press the middle button, go to your settings and then go offline. Now this needs to be done incredibly quickly and this is why the time is kind of hard to get down. But as soon as you've gone online, go back online and you'll get this error message pop up on your screen. You just want to close it and then press A to start. And what it'll do is it'll start logging you in again. 
Now guys, the way you can tell if this glitch has actually worked is you're going to see an error message pop up on the screen that is talking about verifying the purchase. If you got that error message, as you can see there, then you know that the glitch has worked 100% correctly and you are good to carry on going. You want to press A to continue and what's going to happen is it's going to load you to the screen where you can click A to learn more again. However, all we're going to do is it's pretty simple. We're just going to go ahead and uh, we're going to go back to the menu as you're going to see in a few seconds. We're going to go back and then we're going to go back and save the world. And for some reason, guys, it's going to load us straight into the actual game. So, yeah, guys, that's pretty much going to finish up the glitch. And, uh, yeah, I'm just going to let it kind of fast forward through the next bit so you guys can see that it does actually load in. In okay, case some people don't believe me. But, uh, yeah, that's going to pretty much finish up. If this does actually help you, make sure to drop a like. But other than that, guys, I'll see you in the next video.